What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I'd like to talk about Dead Silence not being available in Modern Warfare 2 and also no classic minimap being available. First of all, let's talk about Dead Silence. Dead Silence will not be a perk in Modern Warfare 2. Instead, it will be a field upgrade. So the same kind of thing we saw Infinity Ward do with Modern Warfare 2019. Now this is a bit controversial. If you like Dead Silence, you're probably going to be unhappy with this. If you're not a fan of people using Dead Silence, you're probably going to be very happy about this. So once again, this is going to be, uh, like I said, a field upgrade. It will be something that's on a timer. You know, you'll have to, the better you play, the quicker you may be able to unlock it. I'm not sure if it's going to be one of those, it's going to be a quick unlock, kind of one of those medium grades or, you know, a longer up unlock. I'm assuming it'll probably be kind of like Modern Warfare 2019 where you can unlock it pretty quickly if you're playing well. But of course, it only lasts a certain amount of time. And also, you're not going to be able to get it, you know, just all the time. You're going to be able to get it a few times a game. So that's going to allow the players to use it when they want. You'll have to be a little bit kind of smart with using, you know, how Dead Silence uh, or how you want to use your Dead Silence throughout the match. Now, depending on how footstep sounds are going to be in game, I don't really have a huge issue with this. If footstep sounds are really loud, that's going to kind of be a problem. But if footstep sounds are not that loud, I really don't have an issue with Dead Silence being just a field upgrade. Now, the other thing that kind of has a bit of controversy around it is no classic minimap being in uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Yesterday, Infinity Ward tweeted out there is no red dot on the minimap in Modern Warfare 2. They're kind of going back to what they did in Modern Warfare 2019, the kind of thing, same thing we saw Sledgehammer do with Call of Duty Vanguard, where if you're firing your weapon, you're not going to show up as a red dot on that map. They said they want to keep players focused on what's in front of them instead of chasing dots on the minimap. It's kind of how they worded it. There is one exception to this, kind of like Call of Duty Vanguard. We had radar. There will be a perk in Modern Warfare 2 called Bird's Eye. Now, the only difference is Bird's Eye will be in the fourth perk slot, which is known as a ultimate perk. The ultimate perks are not active as soon as you start playing around. The ultimate perks kind of build up like field upgrades. Once you get to a certain point, you've had enough kills, you got enough XP, you kept enough objectives, that ultimate perk will finally unlock. So kind of like some of the perk systems we saw back in older Call of Duty games, back like Modern Warfare 3, where you had these different perks that could unlock over time, that's how the bird's eye perk will be as well. So if you want to still use that radar, you want to see the radar like you would have in the past, where if there's a person on the map firing an unsilenced weapon, you can see that red dot pop up. You will have that option called bird's eye, but it's not going to be available to you as soon as the round starts. You're going to have to start playing pretty well to unlock that bird's eye perk. And yesterday, uh, Infinity Ward kind of gave us an idea of how long this takes. I said the base timers on most of these ultimate perks are like four to eight minutes. And of course, you know, that speeds up the better you play. So it's going to be interesting to see if anyone even uses Bird's Eye. I think a lot of people use Radar in Vanguard. But considering uh, Bird's Eye is not going to be something that you're going to get from the start of the game. It's something you're going to kind of have to build up to. I'll be curious to see if anyone decides to use it or not. So leave me a comment, guys. Let me know. Are you happy that there's no dead silence perk in the game? Are you happy with the, um, you know, no classic minimap? Or would you have rather Infinity Ward go back to kind of what we've always seen in Call of Duty over the years? Well, not the last couple of years, but way in the past, you know, for several years, you know, eight, nine, ten years there, we saw dead silence. We saw classic minimaps. So leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.